What happens when a boxing legend meets betrayal face to face? What could push a loyal protege to throw a punch at his mentor in the middle of a press conference? And what kind of chaos erupts when the son of a notorious family steps into the ring? These questions are just the tip of the iceberg in today's story. So stick around because what went down between Floyd Mayweather, Gervonta Tank Davis, and John Gotti is something you won't believe until you hear every jaw-dropping detail. Imagine this a press conference that's supposed to be routine. Floyd Mayweather, the undefeated boxing icon, is standing at the podium, doing what he does best talking about his illustrious career, hyping up his upcoming fight with John Gotti, and reminding everyone why he's still the greatest. The room is electric, filled with media, fans, and the kind of anticipation that only a Mayweather event can create. Everything is going according to plan until suddenly, out of the corner of the room, a shadow emerges Gervonta Tank Davis. Now, if you know Tank, you know this guy doesn't just show up to sit quietly in the background. The moment he steps into the spotlight, the atmosphere shifts. Tank is a fighter known for his raw talent and fiery temperament, but today, something is different. He's not here to support Floyd or to promote the fight. No, Tank has a bone to pick, and he's not waiting for a private moment to address it. The room, once filled with excitement, now buzzes with a different kind of energy tension, thick and heavy, like the calm before a storm. And just like that, the storm hits. Out of nowhere, Tank starts throwing shade at Floyd, and not the playful kind. These are sharp, cutting words, filled with years of pent-up frustration. The press conference, which was supposed to be about Floyd and Gotti, suddenly shifts focus. It's no longer just a promotional event, it's a battlefield, and the real fight isn't even in the ring yet. The crowd is stunned, the cameras are rolling, and all eyes are on the two men who were once like family. Tank's anger isn't just about the present. It's about the years he spent under Floyd's wing, learning from him, growing under his guidance, only to feel overshadowed by Floyd's ever-present ego. Floyd, the master of the spotlight, has always been larger than life. And for a rising star like Tank, that's not always easy to handle. It's clear that Tank has reached his breaking point, and he's not going to let this moment pass without making his feelings known. But let's not forget about the third man in this saga, John Gotti. Gotti, with a name that carries a weight all its own, was supposed to be the main event. This was his chance to prove himself, to show the world that he's more than just a famous last name. But now, as he stands there watching Floyd and Tank go at it, you can't help but wonder what's going through his mind. How does it feel to have your big moment hijacked by a drama that has nothing to do with you? For Gotti, this isn't just another fight, it's personal and now it's become something even more complicated. Tank doesn't just stop at words. The tension escalates, and before anyone can intervene, Tank lunges at Floyd. The room erupts into chaos. This isn't just a press conference anymore, it's a full-blown confrontation. Tank's not just throwing verbal punches, he's ready to throw real ones. The security rushes in, trying to keep the two fighters apart, but the damage is already done. In that moment, it's clear that the relationship between Floyd and Tank has been shattered beyond repair. But why? Why would Tank, who owes much of his success to Floyd, turn on him so publicly? The answer lies in a history of simmering tensions, betrayals, and a desire to break free from Floyd's control. Tank has always been hungry hungry for the spotlight, for success, for respect. But standing in his way has always been Floyd, the man who helped him rise, but also the man who seems to cast a shadow over everything Tank has achieved. Floyd, on the other hand, is used to being in control. He's built an empire on his terms, and he's not one to let go of power easily. But even he couldn't have predicted this. Floyd's always been the strategist, the one who stays five steps ahead. But now, he's caught off guard, facing a challenger he never expected his own protege. And for someone like Floyd, who's built his career on being untouchable, this moment is a serious blow to his pride. Meanwhile, Gotti is left to pick up the pieces of what was supposed to be his moment. He's no stranger to pressure, but this is something else entirely. Gotti was prepared to fight Floyd in the ring, but now he's dealing with a whole new level of drama. And if you think Gotti's just going to stand by and let his moment be overshadowed, think again. Gotti has his own legacy to live up to, and he's not going to let this opportunity slip through his fingers. As the dust settles, the questions start swirling. What happens next? Will Tank and Floyd take this beef to the ring? Will Gotti get his shot at redemption? Or will this drama derail everything? The fans are on the edge of their seats, 
and the boxing world is buzzing with speculation. This isn't just about a fight anymore, it's about betrayal, pride, and the complicated relationship between mentor and student. But the story doesn't end there. There's another twist that adds even more fuel to the fire. Floyd has been secretly helping Tank's opponents, giving them tips on how to beat him. For Tank, this is the ultimate betrayal. How could the man who's supposed to be in his corner turn around and help the other side? It's a stab in the back that Tank can't ignore, and it only deepens the rift between him and Floyd. You can feel the tension rising with every word. Tank isn't just angry he's hurt, and that pain is driving him to make decisions that could change the course of his career. But Floyd, ever the strategist, knows how to play the game. He's been in the ring with the best, and he's faced down challengers before. But this time, it's different. This time, the challenger isn't just another opponent, it's someone who knows Floyd better than anyone else. And what about the fans? They're watching all of this unfold with a mixture of shock and excitement. This isn't just another boxing feud, it's something deeper, more personal. The kind of drama that keeps you glued to the screen, wondering what's going to happen next. The hype around a potential tank vs. Floyd's showdown is through the roof, and if that fight ever happens, it's going to be one for the ages. But before we get there, there's still the matter of the upcoming fight between Floyd and Gotti. Gotti's father has already warned that this fight is going to be different. Gotti isn't treating this like an exhibition he's coming to win, and he's more motivated than ever. With all the drama surrounding Floyd and Tank, Gotti sees an opportunity to make his own mark, to step out of the shadows and into the spotlight. So where does this leave us? The boxing world is on the brink of something huge. Floyd Mayweather, the undefeated champion, is facing challenges from all sides his former protege wants to take him down, and John Gotti is looking to make history by defeating a living legend. And with rumors swirling about a potential tank vs. Floyd fight in the near future, it's clear that this story is far from over. As we head into the next chapter, one thing is certain the stakes have never been higher. Floyd Mayweather has always been the king of the ring, but now he's facing challenges he never expected. Gervonta Davis is ready to break free and claim his own place in history, while John Gotti is determined to prove that he's more than just a name. The drama, the tension, the unexpected twists, this is what makes boxing so thrilling. And for fans, it's a front row seat to one of the most exciting stories in sports. So buckle up, because the ride isn't over yet. The next few months are going to be crucial in determining who comes out on top. Will Floyd maintain his undefeated record, or will Tank finally get his shot at dethroning the king? And can Gotti shock the world by taking down one of the greatest fighters of all time? The answers are coming, and when they do, they're going to shake the boxing world to its core. In the end, it all comes down to this, who has what it takes to stand at the top? Floyd Mayweather, the master strategist and undefeated champion? Gervonta Davis, the hungry fighter ready to step out of his mentor's shadow? Or John Gotti? the underdog with a legacy to uphold and a point to prove. The clock is ticking, the tension is building, and the world is watching. This is more than just boxing, this is a battle for legacy, pride, and respect. And when it all goes down, you can be sure that it's going to be a fight like no other. So stay tuned, because you won't want to miss a second of what's coming next.